Imagine a car that looks like a collision between a refrigerator and a scooter. Meet the Aceta, the iconic bubble car that took the world by storm in the 1950s. Originally designed in Italy, the Aceta was the brainchild of engineer and businessman Renzo Revolta. Inspired by the post-war demand for small and affordable cars, Revolta set out to create a vehicle that would revolutionize urban transportation. Manufactured by the Italian firm ISO Spa, the Aceta quickly became known for its unique design. With its small size, measuring only 2.29 meters long and 1.37 meters wide, and its distinctive egg-shaped body, the Aceta turned heads wherever it went. One of the most striking features of the Aceta was its front door. Resembling a refrigerator door, it hinged outwards, allowing easy access to the car's interior. In case of an accident, the driver and passenger could even exit through the canvas sunroof. Inside the Aceta, you would find a single bench seat that provided reasonable comfort for two occupants. Behind the seat, there was a spacious parcel shelf and a spare wheel. Ventilation was provided by opening the front triangle windows or the fabric sunroof. Powering the Aceta was a 236 cubic centimeter split single two-stroke motorcycle engine, generating 7.1 kilowatts of power. With a manual gearbox offering four forward speeds and reverse, the Aceta could reach a top speed of about 75 kilometers per hour. The Aceta's narrow track and solid rear axle with closely spaced rear wheels eliminated the need for a differential. The front axle featured a modified version of a Dubonnet independent front suspension, ensuring a smooth ride. As the Aceta gained popularity, BMW saw an opportunity and acquired the license for the car. They redesigned the power plant, using a BMW one-cylinder, four-stroke, 247 cubic centimeters motorcycle engine. This marked the birth of the BMW Aceta. In April 1955, the first BMW Aceta rolled off the production line. Over the years, BMW made significant changes to the car, making it distinct from its Italian predecessor. In May 1962, after producing a total of 161,728 units, BMW ceased production of the Aceta. The Aceta may have been small, but its impact on the automotive industry was enormous. It paved the way for the development of microcars and influenced the design of future compact vehicles. Today, the Aceta remains an iconic symbol of innovation and creativity. So, next time you see a small car zipping through the city streets, remember the Aceta, the world's first microcar that started it all. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more fascinating stories from the world of automobiles.